So today I am wearing my Topshop kimono, Topshop crop top, and my fixed clothing shorts. We're going out in Norwich and we're going to find all 50 gorillas which are scattered around. <laughs> what did you get? Actually there's 53, not 50. Second one, this is my brother, and this is my brother's Hi. girlfriend, Kylie. Focus. Posing for a picture. Cameraman Jack. What's the letter? There. And we're making up the words. Zero. Yeah. Batman. It's not focusing. Leanne, Batman. <laughs> you enjoying it? Yes. Look at the face on this one. <laughs> it looks really creepy. He <laughs> mad had a lot of calf kids and cups. I was having a We found four so far. And well, five so far, so we've still got quite a few to go. Nick is here. It's really good. Yeah. No, I did a butterfly on his head. Mary Selfie. What's her, how do you say her surname? Del, I say I'm Del not really Fingy. sure. She's a model. Delvingi. Cara, that model, is what I say. I always say her name is Cara Delvingi. It's a cathedral. It's just teeth, teeth of titties. But, forum, castle. Does all that have that like, build a bit to it? No. Why? This is Iron Man. The other one's Thingy. Oh, yeah. Transformers. Don't. Yeah, the best one up there. It's our castle. It looks a little bit like a water tower though. Kylie's, we've had a bit of a... What's she doing? She threw the map away. What's been your favourite one so far? Iron Man. But I think I'm going to like this one. Yeah. One up here. I don't know if you can see. Transformers one, but I've just got corrected by a child that is. Optimus Prime. Yeah. So we're going up to the castle. Ooh. Morning. Search continues. What was it? Oh my god, that's huge. Is that two? Can I stand at the front then? Another wing. Transform. <laughs> <laughs> what was that? That's really cute. Are you going to be like butterflies next to it for your picture? More of a bird, bird though, never mind. Of it has wings. Special hands. Oh, its face is really scary. It's painted like their youth activity bus. It's a race. Number seven. We've missed six, ten, eleven. Cathedral. Castle. This one looks weird. And those are from when we had elephants around Norwich a couple of years ago, I think. So, so you can do your own, that's cool. $15.99. Monkey. <laughs> it's up there. Yeah, it's down, down And we've done how many? 18. 18. 
look at the detail on the face. He's got pockets. He's younger and that's so funny that the face detector still picks up a face. Yeah. City Hall. Yes. Look at the castle on its butt. Forest. Forum. And this is the forum, our library. So this is the one that got removed. Yeah. So there's nothing there. It's cross-eyed. Uh. Looks all confused. You're so shiny. And the BBC's in the forum. So, so far we've done 24, so we've almost done, well, I'm about to say half, but it's better be 53. Three hours and we found 24. Yeah. Spotted one up there. And there's one just here. Oh, it's so pretty. This is Chapterfield Gardens. Queen's Jubilee, and we did a shoot like on the bandstand. All of the unfinished beds. <laughs> <laughs> Let's look at the windows. This one is sixteen It's got eyelashes. You got a growl like a tiger. Growl like a tiger. Because it's tigers. Oh, I can't see that. Side. That's quite cool. Growl. Do their hands. <laughs> no, that's so gammed. What's the point? Growl like a tiger. We can't get to this one because it's behind bars. <laughs> we went to do one of the other ones and it is closed in Marks and Spencers, so we can't do one of them today. The Damn it. Damn it. Aww. That's so cute. I like this oh, one. That's, that, that's the albino newt. <laughs> The wonky house. Yeah, it works. <laughs> Ooh, smells good. Like Cathedral. Yeah, there you go. Cathedral. He's definitely touched that one, isn't he? <laughs> He's had a tight Jaguar. Yeah. one in the distance. Yeah. It's so pretty around here. It's number... Wow. Yeah. Oh, it's got a big poo on it. But... Be chance. Is that it for today? Yeah. yeah. My feet hurt. <laughs> My feet hurt. To the car. How many do you think we did? 40, I reckon. Batman! Woo! We've still got um, more to do. We did 42. I think we're going to do those in two weeks' time. So today is Wednesday. Yesterday, obviously Tuesday, my friend came and she did my roots. So, no more roots. They are a little bit warm though, but it's better than the big black band that I had in my hair. I didn't film it being done but I did film like the stuff I used. We did two scoops of the bleach powder when actually I only really needed one scoop for my roots and then we filmed measuring in the developer. <laughs> <laughs> I did 
didn't film us doing the hair because there are so many videos out there on YouTube on how to do it properly and my friend had never done it before so we didn't necessarily do it properly and it was an experience and stuff didn't go quite to plan. She was being careful when like painting my roots not to overlap onto the bleach that was there before but she was being so careful she didn't paint up to so when I washed out my hair I had a band down here of dark. I'm thinking of going pastel pink but I think I'm going to wait till I get my roots done again so that they're not warm. I don't really like a warm pink salmon colour in my hair which my roots would go that colour. Also the Blonde Me stuff is amazing. The lift on it I used 9% developer with the bleach powder when before my friend who was a hairdresser was doing my hair she was using 12% which was 40 vol and it wasn't lifting my hair enough like the roots were a lot warmer than this so it wasn't lifting it enough and I was in a lot of pain but this there was no pain at all, no uncomfortable tingling or anything. I think I'll do a blog post kind of reviewing and um, talking about that. I'm not sure if I'll do that in the video but I just wanted to tell you guys that it was really good. As my hair is now more of a silvery kind of white colour I had to show my extensions. My extensions were platinum blonde and my hair is more silvery now. Um, to tone them all I did was fill up the sink with lukewarm water and I poured in my silver shampoo and then added the extensions and kind of waited till they went a kind of visibly bluey grey colour, more of a grey colour really, and then rinse them out, put some leave-in conditioner and I let them dry. The results are really good, my hair is now more of a silvery grey colour so that matches quite well with my hair. Excuse my skin, I've stopped wearing foundation as the weather's been amazing and I have a tan and yeah my face still is not um, dark enough as my hands. I've started using bronzer, I really like the elf bronzer I got in my last haul video. I didn't actually really like the barrier one, I found that made me look a bit muddy. Elf bronzer, it really matches the colour of my nose which sounds weird. My nose always tans really well so I've been using bronzer to kind of catch up the colour rather than concealing my nose and making my face look paler. I thought I'd show you some things that arrived today. I got this really lovely leaf wrap ring from Regal Rose, it's sterling silver and the leaves are shells which are really really pretty. I got this unicorn necklace which is crystal, it's really heavy actually, I was quite surprised at the weight and this one's really really pretty. Another green thing, I got this green tie-dye t-shirt from Paris and Cuffs and it says Paris and Cuffs on it. I'm thinking of um, cutting it just below the logo. If you saw my Instagram I did a picture of this on me and I rolled it up saying I think I look really nice as cropped up. So yeah I'm gonna take some scissors to that and I'm gonna cut that up soon. So today is Thursday, I'm about to go into town with my mum. Nothing really special, we're just gonna like pop into town, we pop into some shops and it's so nice outside so I thought I'd just film a little bit of my day. I would show you my outfit but I'm actually wearing what I wore on Sunday, you know, if I really like an outfit, nothing wrong with wearing it again, you know, days later. Um, but I'm wearing different accessories, different jewellery, so I'll show you those. The ring that I got from Regal Rose, I really, really love this. It goes really nicely with my tan. And of course I'm wearing my Bohemian Collective rings. I featured the, this one in my favourite and this one in another favourite. Um, these are my go-to silver rings at the moment. And my necklace is from Traditional Heart. It's really, really pretty and it's like a almost a baby pink. I thought it goes really nicely with the colours in my kimono. So I'm going to post the parcel, the um, ring from my giveaway, posting that today to the lucky winner, Rebecca Primark. May have made a purchase in Primark. So I'm feeling a bit hungry, so mum's going to treat me to pretzels. Yeah. Looks so good. Look at the macaroons. This place looks amazing. Yummy. They all look so good. <laughs> Norwich looks so pretty when it's sunny. She just got back home from the city of my mum and on the way back the bus driver asked if I was childfare. So I always thought childfare was like 15 and under so I was like wow I look that young and he was like no it's 19 and under. I could have got away with it but I was like ah no I'm 23 and 24 in under a month now but I don't look it. Not a bad thing. I will appreciate that when I'm older. Also my dad didn't want his pretzel so I get to have another one. It was three for five pounds which usually they're £3 each, so that was quite good. I thought I'd also show you what I got in Primark. It's a really cool necklace, it's only £2.50 as well. It comes with spare letters, so you can put what you want on the bottom. 
and they didn't have the sandals that I wanted. The sandals that I filmed, the white ones, they only had size 5 and I'm size 4. And also I'll show you the two piece that I bought from Laura Ralph. I looked on the girl's Facebook page and she makes two pieces so I had to get one for myself and I really really love this print and luckily it was still available. This is my two piece on. It's I just realised I hadn't explained why I suddenly got my extensions in so I got home from the city and I put them in because I'm going to do some outfit pictures outside as the weather's really nice. So that's the end of my vlog. Sorry it wasn't quite the same as my last one where I film like every day and some days I didn't really do anything or I didn't want to film us doing my hair because we weren't exactly doing it right but please thumbs up if you did like this and please let me know if you want to see more vlogs as my last one was really popular and yeah I want to do more. I hope everyone's enjoying the amazing weather in the UK please comment like and subscribe and thank you for watching